Welcome to our quick review of the Mudder floating head strap, which we purchased from Amazon this week for the bargain price of £5.29 here in the UK. This is a two in one device comprised of a standard head strap with a flotation panel which attaches via Velcro. This device is designed to be used for water sports, including jet skiing, canoeing, windsurfing, surfing, etc., and provides a very good quality mount at a bargain price. As you can see from the underwater footage, the camera is attached here and it's been suspended underwater by the flotation panel which remains on the surface. It hangs around 12 inches down, the width of the head strap, and as you can see by me throwing this in and out of the water, it provides sufficient buoyancy to maintain not only the head strap but also the GoPro camera attached. Taking the camera off, we can see that the flotation panel is outlined in a bright orange it's very easy to see in the water and make sure that it would be easy to locate your device should an accident occur. The materials used throughout are of excellent quality for £5.29. It's really an excellent device. The only downside to this particular device is the fact that we felt that the Velcro straps used to attach the flotation panel to the head strap were maybe insufficient. For high impact water sports, we would probably just run some tape around the end of either side of the flotation device to make sure it's fully secured to the head strap. The grip, the mounts and everything else are of excellent quality and are more than sufficient for most users. For the benefit of those of you who have not used the head strap before, this sample clip should give you an idea as to the type of footage that this device will give you. We're out here off the coast of the North East in the UK in the North Sea Travelling at anything between 30 and 60 miles per hour on a jet ski, you get bounced around quite a lot on this and you still get some relatively smooth footage. One of the primary advantages is that wherever you look, effectively, the camera direction will be there too. Consequently, it's not quite as stable as a chest mount, uh, but this should give you a rough idea as to if a head strap will meet your particular needs.